When it comes to horror movies, exorcism is a vital aspect. From classic Hollywood to modern cinema, much of a horror genre has evolved. But the elements of possession and exorcism are pretty much the same. That's why the film Gossips has brought to you this scary video. And today, we are going to look at the top 5 best exorcism scenes from Hollywood. But before we start, you have been warned about the spoilers ahead. At number 5, we got The Possession. There are some horror films that are based on a simple plot, but thanks to the genius of the director, these films are worthy of your praise. This film falls in the same category. Released in 2012, this film is directed by the Danish filmmaker Ole Bondal. Based on a novel, this film stars Geoffrey Dean Morgan, Cara Sedgwick, and Natasha Kallis in lead roles. A story follows a young girl who found an antique wooden box in the market. After bringing home this box, the girl became obsessed with it. Soon, she started to exhibit signs of possession. So, her parents bring a priest who performs an exorcism on her. Upon its release, it received mixed reviews from critics, but the film was a major box office success. It crossed over $83 million against a production budget of $14 million. It became very popular among the public for its horror scenes, especially the last exorcism. It also received positive reviews for its authenticity from critics. That's the reason this horror film is included in our list too. Hi. Hey. You're late. Hey kiddo. You ready to go? I'll have him back Sunday after lunch. Just healthy food, okay? No pizza? Cool. Daddy, can I get this? Whatever you want, kiddo. I think whoever made this didn't want anybody to open it. Slow down. Damn. Slow down! Hebrew inscription. It says Dibbik. It's the Hebrew word for demon. At number four, we got Deliver Us from Evil. Scott Derrickson has made a handful of films in his career. In these films, Stark has made some of the best modern horrors of the last decade. This film is one of them and you can see his amazing work in it. Directed by Stark Derrickson, it was released in 2014. Starring Eric Bana, Edgar Ramirez, and Olivia Munn in title characters. Its premise revolves around an ex-cop who encounters a spree of bizarre murders. After investigation, he discovers the presence of demons behind these killings. The film is full of thrill, horror, and a little bit of mystery. Its best scene in The Exorcism, which comes at the ending of the film, it received positive reviews for the performance, storyline, and horror scenes. It also performs very well at the box office and earned more than $87 million. If you are looking for a supernatural horror film with mystery and thrill, then you should start with this. As a cop, I've seen some horrible things. She split against the crowd, now we can't find her. She must be hiding somewhere in the park. I believe Jane's problem to be spiritual. At number 3, we got The Conjuring. If you are a fan of the horror genre, then you shouldn't be surprised to see this title. This is the first chapter of The Conjuring Universe. Directed by talented James Wan, it is written by Chad Hayes. It features Patrick Wilson, Vera Farmiga, and Lily Tyler in the lead roles. Based on the true events, this film depicts the encounters of Ed and Lorraine Warren, the real-life demonologists. The plot is based on the exorcism of Carolyn Perrin, who was possessed by an evil entity. It is full of horror scenes and jump scares which are highly praised by everyone. But the ending, where exorcism is performed, still gives an eerie chill to our bones. 
Conjuring was well received by critics and the public. It became one of the major successes at the box office and surpassed the figure of $319 million in ticket sales. It also received numerous awards including a Saturn Award and the Best Horror Film of the Year. I get my own room. Oh, you really? can't really hear me. Oh, no. I call it on the room. Clap. I'm gonna get you now. <laughs> you took your blindfold off. I win. I was in Christine and Nancy's room. There's something horrible happening in my house. At number 2, we got The Exorcist. This is literally a film which pioneered the concept of demonic possession and exorcism in movies. Although there are attempts with the same idea, but it is the first film which made it worldwide famous. Based on a novel, it was directed by William Fredkin. It stars Alan Burstyn, Linda Blair, and Jason Miller in the lead characters. Its plot is based on a possession of a 12-year-old girl and her exorcism by two priests. This film still ranks in the top place as the greatest horror film of all time. It became a massive hit and crossed over $441 million against a budget of $12 million. Its success makes the path for its sequels. To this day, every ranking list of horror films or scenes is incomplete without this movie. My bed was shaking. Do you think I should take her to a psychiatrist? The problem with your daughter is not her bed. It's her brain. I know you're gonna feel a little stick here. I don't want it! Take his feet out! Honey, is that how? Come on! Respect you! Do you know what she did? Our father. At number 1, we got The Exorcism of Emily Rose. If you want to see the best exorcism scene ever filmed in Hollywood, then go and watch this film. Based on true events, this horror film just gives goosebumps throughout many scenes. It stars Jennifer Carpenter, who portrayed the character of Emily Rose. It describes the story of Emily, a 19-year-old girl who is possessed by a demon. Her parents called a priest who performs an exorcism on her, but he failed and Emily died during the exorcism. The entire film has a dark environment and violent scenes of exorcism. It received positive reviews for its theme, pace, and performance of Jennifer Carpenter. It is the best film for those who love the concept of demonic possession and exorcism. I don't care about my reputation. What I care about is telling Emily Rose's story. <gasps> Demons exist whether you believe in them or not. <laughs> Emily had epilepsy. Father Moore's beliefs are based on superstition. Just be careful, Aaron. There are forces surrounding this trial. Did Father Moore ask you to give her any medical help? I couldn't help her. Why couldn't you help her? Because there are no injections against the devil. If you like this video, then don't forget to subscribe to Film Gossips. And if you want to stay updated with newer arrivals, then be sure to hit the bell icon.